Well, there are so many things to do in Denver, and you can add catching the latest perform performance of Cirque du Soleil at the Pepsi Center to that list. Yeah, and it starts tomorrow, Molly. Cirque has 19 different shows wow. this year. It's unreal. Curios is the latest one taking over Denver for the next couple of months. And one of the unique performances of the show is an aerial biker. So me, this guy, went behind oh, the gosh. scenes today to see how the magic is made. bike so everything is moving it really gives the effect that I'm, I'm flying in the tent and there's no training wheels on this bike I see so you're just up there you know ready yeah. to go right <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> there's no break no break <laughs> and Weisbecker has been a sort of performer for five years I started when I was a kid when I was 11 she basically designed this bike performance herself to fit the show sometimes when you see the bike like oh I will try that and then you climb on it and it's so unstable everything is moving it's a real bike so sometimes it was not that easy. Not that easy is right, as Anne taught me a basic move, the spin cycle. If I end up throwing up, is that a bonus for you? So you just come down like this and go. <laughs> How was the dismount? That's good. I stuck the landing. She enjoys life on the road. Two months in a city and then move on. Payoff is showtime. I think it's a, it's a great reaction when people see it flying and at one point you go upside down and then riding upside down to see the reactions and to see adults and children who can just uh, be amazed and dream. That's a, a great reaction. I can't, I, I'm not going to lie. I, I'm a little disappointed. You've what? been bragging all afternoon about your big, you know, bike tricks. You didn't even do the upside down straddle spin. No, I just kind of held on and fell. So. <laughs> but I'm okay in case you're wondering. My back's oh, good. All right. I'm glad. We were all worried. All right, again, Cirque starts tomorrow, Molly. 